What's up, y'all? So I've been kind of addicted to Marvel Snap. Doesn't work perfectly on Steam, as you can see by this uh, <laughs> awesome display. But the fact that you can play on Steam and your phone is what I love. Um, I like that with Yu-Gi-Oh! and Magic, but my phone can't fit all those cards on the screen. This is optimized for mobile, so it's, it's beautiful. Anyway, that's not the point. The point is, the game really wants you to play with Gambit right now, as you can see by the uh, by Gambit and Rogue. Rogue kind of sucks, so I decided to make Gambit a deck, and it's carried me from 0 to 50 very, very quickly. So, let's just get into what it is. It is a discard deck. Um, pretty, pretty normal stuff. Um, with two added things that make it pretty strong. Uh, first off, we got Blade. Very simple. Um, he is a one cost, but I never play him first, even if he's in my hand. He's just, uh, he always discards the wrong thing first. I'm kind of, I'm kind of mad at Blade. I'm going to be real. Morbius just fits in there. Plus two power each time you discard a card in this game. Wonderful that this ongoing works without him having to be out first. That's the important part. You can throw him out last on turn six if you have to, and he will still have this bonus from every card you discarded without him having to be on the field yet. The collector's a little bit different. This is not an ongoing ability, so he has to be out while you discard things. These two synergize extremely well with Swarm. Uh, this game has a couple win conditions, or this deck rather. Um, Swarm getting nailed a couple times and getting a bunch of stacks for Collector uh, works very well uh, along with some other things. Uh, obviously we have our, our Gambit boy. Um, he, his stats suck, but this on reveal of destroying an enemy card is enough to make people quit. And that's what I'm having fun with. Also, we have Lockjaw. So this is not a cheap deck. Uh, this card is fantastic. I love Lockjaw. Lockjaw makes the game so much fun. With any on-reveal deck, you can just uh, have a blast. Like, you just, you never know what's going to happen. It's not super, like, okay. It's not reliable if you build your deck wrong. Otherwise, like, otherwise it's always going to be positive. And that's what's kind of nice with this deck. Almost everything that comes out, the only thing he can put out that sucks is Apocalypse, because you want him at the end of your game. But every other card, um, minus Swarm, is totally worth coming out for Lockjaw. Uh, Lady Sif and Swordmaster, these two are in every discard deck just because they do exactly what you want them to. Swordmaster's got some good stats on top of it. Um, Dracula, this is a game winner. This is why you want Apocalypse in your hand at the end. At the end of the game, he will discard Apocalypse from your hand, more often than not. And this not only gives him Apocalypse's power, but also procs the Collector, and also procs Morbius. Uh, another expensive card, Wong. If you have him, awesome. If not, I, you know, there, you might want to swap in Ghost Rider. I might swap, I, I would swap him out for Ghost Rider if I had it. Ghost Rider would fit this deck way better. Um, because the problem with Wong is that he is a fantastic card. Your on reveal abilities at this location happen twice. Cool. Problem is he's, he costs four. So I never get him out. If you can get Wong and Lockjaw on the same page somehow, that is the end of the game. But by that time, it's usually turn five, and the game is already over. So we just kind of hope we can get him out somehow. Maybe some something gives you extra uh, energy, some some location procs that gives you some that draws him out or some I don't know. But we can always hope. Um, he is not technically the win condition. The win condition is more so lockjaw playing lockjaw and then dropping discards so they proc each other and do cool things ella is a great card if she doesn't get destroyed immediately all my <laughs> they just all these cards love to target hella i don't know why then she dies and she's useless um and then obviously apocalypse he just he's just the staple for any discard deck so let's let's go ahead and run some games and see how it works in action That is not the Hulk. This is like the anti-Hulk. There's a turn seven. Limbo is good. I like Limbo. Um, we're gonna snap. 
I like seeing Morbius. I like seeing the Collector right off the bat. We're going to want to play the Collector first. Um, because he needs to be on the field to get his bonuses. I like seeing these Rocket Raccoon. I like seeing these Guardians of the Galaxy decks because they're never the greatest. All right, we can't use mid. So we're going to hope that location three isn't awful as well. Two locations is fine. We want to win with two locations on this deck. And we got Lockjaw out. Oh, this is, this is good. This is tasty. We're off to a good start. I swear, this card needs... He's going to get nerfed or changed. Something's going to happen with Lockjaw. So, in a perfect world, we will drop... So we have, we have four cards here that we want to drop. We're going to drop Swordmaster. We're going to drop Blade. Hopefully, you know, Swordmaster procs. Maybe he swaps out for Wong. That would be the greatest. If either of these cards swap out for Wong, I'm a happy camper. Since Wong is still in our deck and Lockjaw pulls a card out of your deck. That's not great. But hopefully we get Hella. Lady Sif, that's fine. This is good. And Dracula. So now I want to draw Wong, because I don't want him to pull Wong on this last situation. But you know what? It's okay. This is okay. Um, we're going to leave these in here. So I can play these whenever. They're zero cost, so... See what happens. Let's see if Gambit kills anything useful. The great Gambino Polaris is useful. Oh, good. Wait, no! That's cheating. Oh, well. <laughs> it's alright. It's alright. Oh, hella! Hella dope. Let's go. Oh, Morbius comes back. Oh my god, this is this is this is interesting. Alright. Gambit. I'm expecting great things, Gambit. Don't let me down. Just need to hit one card in the middle. Alright, so Dracula is going to proc this. Hopefully he can't play anything in the middle. That sucks. This is fine. I think we win. This is good, because Dracula is going to do that. It's going to proc Morbius and the Collector. Give us two slots and BAM! This Dracula, Morbius, Collector combo. These three beautiful cards right here. These are killer. This is a killer combo. Look at that, I was talking all that about Wong. He never even came out. All right, I'm seeing we have Lockjaw and Gambit already. We're gonna snap. You know, snapping is if you want to climb, you just have to snap as much as you can. And obviously retreat when you need to, but that's what's important. It's fine if we don't play anything till turn three. I'm not worried about it. Um, I am going to drop Morbius, though, since we picked him up. I don't care about Scorpion. Scorpion means nothing to me. Oh, no. Don't do it. Oh, look at that! See, Hella! Hella just loves getting smoked. <laughs> Hella loves getting Hella smoked. Um, I'd love to put him on Murder World, but I don't... ...see that as an option right now. Hmm. 
All right, nice. Okay, so I am going to... We're gonna drop the collector here. Oh, actually, no, I lied. We're gonna, we're gonna make sure we have Dracula out. We don't want to discard Dracula. So he's gonna drop the dinosaur in mid. Um, let's hope for the best. Oh, Blade, huh? Alright. And that guy. What's this guy do? Oh, he just adds that card to other locations? Okay. This is fine that this this is 20 over here, because... Oh, I forgot to play this guy first. Oh, we got Wong and Lockjaw? And Gambit? Oh, here we go. Here we go. The beauty. The beauty of what's about to happen. Let's go. The beauty. Get him, Gambit. Hit him with the great Gambino. Bah! Shut up, whatever card you were. One more. Bah! Oh, suddenly we're very ahead. Suddenly we're very ahead. This is the combo right here. Double Gambit on Lockjaw. Ooh, Lockjaw didn't even proc that. Did I not have any cards in my... Oh, I had nothing in my deck. That's why. That's still... That's still proc and Gambit that many times. That's how you win the game. Keep going, we'll get one more in. Oh, he's brave. That's all right, I'll snap with you. Look, I'll even do that, kapow. You better make your move though. What kind of deck you got. Oh! He pulls out the Wong! Oh, this is, this is where we want to be. This is, this is MasterCard. It's everything I want it to be. Son. Look at all this goodness that's about to happen. If I pull Lockjaw here. Oh, there's so many good things that could happen. Oh, man. Oh, this is interesting. Okay. Okay. I mean, do we, we could just play it safe and drop. Let's do this. Let's drop this first. Sword? You can drop all them sword? Oh, he wants to go swarms. Okay, okay. I mean I'm I'm tempted to just hold Gambit until the end and then drop four of them on Sinister last move. But wait. Oh, interesting. Hmm. All right, let's let's do this. The combo has not failed me so far. Let's keep it going. 
Okay, final turn. Gambit. Oh, I don't have enough for Dracula. All right, quad gambit. Let's see what happens here. Let's hope for the best. Maybe this will proc Hella. That'd be pretty dope. Go gambit, go. Blow his shit up. If Hella comes out, how many cards do I have here? It's three in my deck. Fingers crossed. Look at this long turn. It's so long. I love it. Come on. Ah, oh, I got mad robbed. All right. Well, we we tried. We tried. That was fun. <laughs> if even if we lose, it's fun. I love blowing up their whole side. Um. But yeah, so that's pretty much it. You know, obviously you win and lose some, but um, that's just a fun deck that'll carry you, you pretty pretty darn high. I'm hoping to get to infinite this time. It's a big grind, but you know, what else am I doing? Anyway, hope that uh, helped, and uh, may you may you snap incredibly well. <laughs> I don't know. Outro. Thanks for watching. Peace.